Hi everyone. In this video, you are going to learn about choice of layers. What are the different layers we have and why we are choosing that particular layer only because um, why we are using that particular layer for only that particular operation. Suppose, what are the different layers you come across in the stick diagrams and layout diagrams? Metal 1, Metal 1, Metal 2, Polysilicon, just list out the layers whatever you have learned so far. Metal 1, Metal 2, Polysilicon, P plus diffusion layer, N plus diffusion layer, P plus diffusion, N plus diffusion and some contact in black color. Okay, so these are the main layers we have metal layer polysilicon layer p plus diffusion and n plus diffusion p plus diffusion is for the p mos transistor creation n plus diffusion is for the n mos transistor metals are for the power supply rails and the polysilicon is for the creation of gate okay why we are using metal for the railing purpose nothing but metal is for vdd and ground VDD and ground. Suppose if you are if you are asked to draw a stick diagram for CMOS inverter, you are simply using a metal lines above and below. Metal lines above and below by giving VDD here and by giving VSS here. What is the reason for taking only metal for the power supply rails? There should be definitely a reason. Okay. And similarly, by the P plus diffusion and N plus diffusion, we are using only for the creation of transistor and nowhere we prefer the diffusion layer to interconnect or any type of material. Hope you remember and understand what I am speaking about. <coughs> okay. All the interconnects should be with the VD, uh, power, uh, what is that? Metal layer. But P plus diffusion and N plus diffusion layers are limited versions. Only wherever the transistor is created, there only the P plus diffusion and N plus diffusion are permitted to. And coming to the polysilicon, polysilicon is of course given to the gate terminal. It is used to create the gate terminal. Thereby, we can also extend it to give the inputs. But more than that, it is not permitted. I keep on saying this, polysilicon is having a maximum of 14% when we are going for the creation of the trans circuits okay so beyond that also it is not preferred so every layer is having some limitation this is all because of this is all because of resistance and resistance and capacitance of those layers resistance and capacitance of those layers suppose if you take vdd and vss for vdd and vss layers vdd and vss power supply lines we can write power supply power supply rails the metal one layer is preferred is preferred as it is having as it is having very low resistance and capacitance every layer is having some resistance and capacitance but provided we should understand that some layers are having low resistance low capacitance and some some are having high resistance and high capacitance and some more are having moderate resistors and moderate capacitors so that's why it is preferably considered to use metal layer for vdd and vss suppose i want to drag this vdd line for the entire circuit whatever wherever i have okay here also i need some vdd then the same line is extended up to this one Okay, here I need the same, then it is extended up to this one. So, just in the entire circuit, the power supply we are taking at one point and it will be uh, 
continued in the entire circuit wherever we are having okay that means the same as the same power connection is continued in the entire circuit the power whatever we are applying 5 volts here at the end also it should be 5 volts without any uh, deviation okay so that's why we are using a low resistance path and a low capacitance path that is done with the help of metal one hope you understand now coming to the uh, long polysilicon wires so long polysilicon already we ha i have explained you what is the propagation delay because of the long polysilicon wire long polysilicon wires are not preferred not preferred because of because of resistance and capacitance because of resistance and capacitance inside okay virtually it is having moderate resistance and moderate capacitance so that it cannot be preferred for more long period if it, if it is preferred then what happens if i am using a distance like this it is the input signal then what happens input will be like this somewhere around it goes to the vdd i am having the input from 0 to vdd at the same instant but 0 to vdd it will take after a long time this is the time gap this is because of the long polysilicon wire okay so that's why polysilicon is also limited it should not be increased in more than a 14 percent in the entire circuitry okay so if you want to go for the interconnections then metal has to be metal is to be preferred okay this is the problem with respect to the long polysilicon wires coming to the diffusion diffusion layers like p plus diffusion or n plus diffusion they are very much limited because of their highest capacitance and highest resistance diffusion layers have high resistance and capacitance hence this layer is not preferred anywhere other than other than diffusion or we can say creating transistors either nmos or pmos okay if you observe the stick diagrams and layout diagrams you can better understand where we have used only diffusion layers diffusion layers we have preferred only at the creation of transistors so polysilicon over diffusion polysilicon this is n plus diffusion and this one is polysilicon again polysilicon this is p plus diffusion only at this particular point we have used the p plus and n plus diffusions and in remaining places we have not yet considered because of its resistance and capacitance this is what the different layers phenomena if you all table it and simply you can easily understand from this table uh, so layer is given what is the value of resistance is given capacitance is given and the corresponding statement is also given whether it is good for uses of particular uh, application or not is also specified clearly see here metal 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 one metal two are there metal one is having low resistance compared to metal two so if you say metal it is having low resistance and low capacitance i have been keep on saying this point right from the beginning of the introduction of uh, stick diagrams and layout diagrams so metal is having very low resistance and low capacitance that's why we can design the most of the part maximum of the part of this stick diagram and layout diagram with the metal okay so good current capability without large voltage drop okay that means the ir drop across this metal layer is very low 
okay and it is having good current capability and mainly used for power distribution and global signals that is for vdd and vss vdd and vss okay that means we can run we can uh, run this vdd through this metal one layer to a long distance so without any deviation the signal can be traveled to a long distance now coming to the silicide silicide polysilicon both are same in the absence of polysilicon material we use this silicide okay uh, the resistance of this silicide is low and the capacitance is moderate so modest rc product always the time delay is a product of resistance and capacitance so we can say it is a moderate time delay reasonably long wires are possible long wires are possible silicide is used in place of polysilicon in some nmos process this is what i told okay silicide is used in place of polysilicon in the nmos fabrication process coming to the polysilicon which is having high resistance and moderate capacitance high resistance and moderate capacitance so what about this rc product time delay it is also moderate high resistance moderate capacitance it is somewhat accepted if capacitance is moderate or low that is okay but if capacitance is high that is never be that will never be considered for more uses because resistance may cause less effect but capacitance increment is having large effect so as the rc product is moderate and it is having high ir drop and next diffusion active diffusion nothing but n plus or p plus diffusions this is what i told you in the previous statement n plus diffusion n plus diffusion p plus diffusion the resistance value is moderate and capacitance is high i told you capacitance is high capacitance high means definitely we should not use this more than the limit so moderate i r drop but high c but high capacitance hence very hard to drive very hard to drive that's why it is not muchly it is not much preferred than the limit okay this is what the choice of layers and uh, where we need to use which layer that is clearly explained in this video clear thank you